Ello and welcome back to Shop With Emo. I'm in Lidl's today and you would honestly think by the size of the trolley that I was in for a massive shop for about a year but actually it was the only trolley I could fit my little trolley on and I didn't want to be dragging two things. Oh well at least I can keep my coat in it. I've come straight into the Christmassy bit which is actually quite good because I wanted to have a little browse and buy some non-perishable Christmas cupboardy items. I suddenly had a rush of happiness earlier when I remembered my daughter would be home and I could buy her some nice things to eat as well. We got some jolly lollies here, 149 quite a big packet but I think maybe she's a little bit old for those. Oh we've got a markdown price on the Moo free selection box for any of your vegan friends here and relatives. What have we got in there? Various bits and bobs look. $2.99 that is now. Gingerbread bites are $1.99 for those. That's dark chocolate. Oh, wait what are you doing in there? We've got milk chocolate bites as well look. That's where he's supposed to be in one of those but I think a child might have ripped him out. <laughs> it's been like that actually. Oops, take two. Oh look at those. I don't know what it is about pink icing. It just looks really appetising to me. That is one big chunky bag of Christmas biscuits there which come in at £2.49. I definitely want a Stollen every year I have to have a Stollen. I'm going to go for the marzipan and hazelnut filling but there is also a poppy seed filling version. That's £2.79. Oh, first item going in soon to be followed by these. These are £2.49 or you could get two for £4. I'm tempted to get two to be honest because I like to think of the 12 days of Christmas you know rather than just one day so they'll be consumed over a couple of weeks. Yeah I'm gonna splash out. I just noticed what amazingly ergonomic handles these are. I can only show you with one hand because I've got the camera in the other one. But you can fit your thumb in. Very comfy. I'm gonna grab myself some fruit. These easy peelers are 69 pence. I soon got through that lot I bought in Tesco's in my last shopping vlog. I actually don't need any veg apart from something green to go with dinner tonight. Well I wanted bananas, <laughs> but do you spot anything strange about these bananas? Well, not so much strange as they're green. And if they're not green, they're yellow but they're bashed and they've got like squished liquidy sections inside if you give them a gentle feel. So I think we won't be getting bananas today. They're all the same. Somebody else just popped along and was having a look and we were chatting about them all being green so he didn't get any either. Broccoli, that's what I'm gonna have for dinner tonight. My boyfriend's coming over so I'm gonna feed him a nice meal hopefully. That's one pound nine for a big block like that. I'm gonna find something a bit different, something maybe a bit pre-prepared that I can put in the oven, something pastry-ish. And I want to have greens with it and potatoes. I already have potatoes at home so I'm not buying potatoes but I'm gonna buy some more mushrooms because I just get through these so quickly. That's 89 pence for a box like that. This little is a bigger one than I normally go to and this does vegan sushi look for £2.09 there if you're interested. And look at that great big one, that big vegan super selection. That is £3.99. I'm keeping an eye out for a pasty because I've got a gig tomorrow. I'm a musician, in case you didn't know that, and I've got a gig. So I need to make a packed lunch and I'm just too lazy to make a sandwich so I'm keeping an eye out for a pasty. Tofu's on my list. Oh, that was a bit noisy. Tofu's on my list. I don't know if this one's going to be any good. It's £1.99. I'm going to give it a go. Oh, my favourite section reduced to clear. What we've got in here then? 40 pence for some fresh double cream. Well, I don't really need it. That's a good value. I'm not going to get it because I can't think of anything to use it with today. What's that? Yoghurt. 44 pence. Yeah, definitely. I get through Greek style yoghurt like nobody's business. So I'll get that. 36 pence for a pint of milk. I think I might get myself some semi-skins. I've been having coffee with cow's milk all week because I got a big bottle of it for 30p and I thought, oh well, let's just have it. So I'm gonna do the same again. Ooh, 76 pence. Eight slices of that and I like that, so I'm gonna get two of those. You can freeze cheese. I suppose I could go crazy, but I'll stop at the two, I think. You know I love my bargains. I called my last shopping vlog reduced to clear heaven and I'm having it again. 167 for those king prawns. Those are massive, big succulent things. That's 2.99, but I'm going to get that, I think. We had a sea of yellow in my trolley in the last vlog. We've got a sea of orange in this one. Oh no! What did they do to bad puss? Well, I've never seen this as a ready meal before. Down to 195 for a rhubarb crumble. I was thinking, well, I don't really like that sort of thing. And then I remembered my boyfriend's coming over for dinner. So I will get that and I might go back and get that cream that was reduced to 40p to go with it. Oh, they got an offer on the Pache Beige de Nata, the Portuguese custard tarts. They're in the frozen section so I can just pop them in the freezer and cook them up for some time when I got my boyfriend and daughter over. 
They do frozen croissants in here as well. I bet they're lovely fresh out of the oven. What I've been on the lookout for is something like, I don't know, salmon in pastry, something like that. I think my boyfriend would really like. Oh, what is some of these? The cheese and onion bakes, they were so good. I had one just after I got back from Portugal when I was sort of out of all perishable food. It was really nice. I uh, haven't been able to find a fresh pasta yet, but I could do one of these and take it with me. Look, they've got stuffed scallop shells there, 3 49 for two. I might give those a miss. Fruit mix for sangria. They've got loads of seasonal things in the freezer section. I was wondering whether you wanted to see them or not, because I'm not actually buying them. I had a look, there's nothing I thought was really suitable for me. Oh, mind you, that's sad. <laughs> I didn't notice that before. Some veggie. Vintage cheddar, cauliflower and spinach pie, but would my boyfriend like it? It's meant for sharing, apparently. Winter sharing pie. 269. I might get it. I'll have a think. They've got Emmental cheese gratins and things like that there. Chicken and chorizo pies, chicken leek and bacon, steak and beef dripping gravy, cod wrapped in bacon, 4.99, white tiger prawns, 6.99. It's a stuffed sea bass there. I've no idea how much that is. I think I will get that. It's not quite what I had in mind. Mushroom and Stilton Wellingtons. Oh, actually, how did I not notice that the first time round? It's not the one with the parsnip in, is it? How many does that serve, I wonder? Right, I'm going to have both. Desserts-wise, that they've got frozen black forest pavlova stack. That looks amazing. 4 99 Poulard. Ooh, that looks so good. I think that's 3 49 We've got macarons. 3 49 Pizza? What's that doing next to that? <sighs> Snowman filled balbums. Not filled with snowmen, I think. 2 99 They've got an actual ham leg. It's an actual thing. I thought, is it just the server? But no, I think it actually is the ham. And it's 34 99 for one like that. 4 49 for the Quality Street. I was thinking I would get a thing at Quality Street, but I'm pretty sure that's cheaper in Asda and Tesco's. I'll check. I'm going to grab some Fanta Zero. That is, oh, 375. It's a bit of an indulgence, to be honest. <laughs> I'm going to grab a couple of bottles of these beer for 149. Um, I'm not sure if I like this brand or not, but I know that I don't like all the others. All the bottles are just too big, you know. So let's do that. They got sewing machines in at the moment for $89.99. I've decided to treat myself to a whole nut chocolate bar. That is 99 pence for that. I'm home. That little lot came to £33.53. Quite a good stash for that lot, I think. Anyway, I've got the dinner on already. I decided that the pie was definitely enough. I had a look at it and it's definitely enough. Yeah, we don't need to do the Wellingtons as well, so they've gone in the freezer for another day. Looking forward to the rhubarb creme wolf for after this. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. Do feel free to subscribe down below to watch more Shop with Imo videos. I have another channel as well, Planet Imo. I'll leave a link to that as well. That's my day in the life vlogging channel. If you enjoyed this video you are very welcome to give it a thumbs up it helps the channel to grow and I'll see you in the next video bye